Hey guys, and today I'll be making a picture previewer in in Visual Basic 2010. Let's start by creating a new project. Uh, is this right? Preview. Ah, that's right. So let's start by uh, let's uh, change the settings on the form to test. I don't know. You can change the start position. Position. I mean, the color. I usually set this to none because when you change the font, the the size also changes, and that's quite annoying. What the heck is that? I don't know. Cool. Anyway, um, uh, just set this to false and false and yeah, like this. Now, first of all, you wanna add a list box on the left. I'm gonna show you why after. Let's just call it LB images. And then add a picture box. Is it like here? I don't know. And then set the uh, Archer, I don't know how you spell it. And PB image. And set this to that. And when you resize it, it also resizes. Now add a button which says change folder. Yeah, and uh, I think that's all. I'm just gonna add a cancel or I mean exit. Oops, exit button. Just call for. Oops. Button change. Do. Then set the answer to uh, whatever you like, but I prefer this settings I mean now uh, everything works fine so let me think I have not planned this tutorial I just came up with it because I'm quite boring I'm uh, quite bored I mean now so let's start by making a sub uh, private sub low load all settings Oops. And in the form loads, when the form loads, it also, our I mean the this sub of course, so it's much easier. So let's me see. Uh, yeah, we make a dim uh, folder. Uh, oops, a string and folder. Was my dot computer dot file system dot special directories dot my pictures, and then make another sub again and name it private sub load folder and I will path a string. Oops. And then just do it like this. This I mean, and take. Um, uh, let me think. Yeah, for each x a string in split. Use this function to split strings. Or yeah. Uh, let me see. Dot. No. Um dot P and G that's right, I think. And dot oops. Uh yeah. Is it like this or yeah it's like this. But, uh, what else what a GPG? GPEG, 
I think that's the same, but just GIF. Um, what else? BMP, yeah. And uh, that. Uh, what else do we got? <laughs> I don't remember all the image files, so I'm just gonna leave it as it is. You can change it whenever you want. I think it's like this. I don't remember. Yeah. PNG, GPG, GPEG, GIF, PM. It splits this, and then this goes away, and. No, wait a minute for each file. File asterisk in new direct io dot directory. Yeah, no info and path. and get files like that okay uh, then just leave it as this <laughs> so oops uh, where's ins there uh, extension okay file info then Um, uh, just import system.io to um, da, 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 you can remove the io dot so it now splits it up so it gets png and da, 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 all in an array of strings so it goes on and on and on until the end where it's not where it's nothing I mean so um, yeah uh, da, 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 list. No, we call it lb images dot items dot add, and then just type in file. So now it loads the folder. I'm just gonna do it like this, and here it is. Now these settings are done. It loads all the folder. Oops, sorry, and. Uh, yeah, loads loads it in here. I can try it just to show you. Yeah, here it is. All the files. <coughs> um, dot. F oops, I did a full name so you can show the full name. Uh, um, where is it? There's a settings scroll label. They choose. No, I mean false. Uh, where, where, where? Hmm. Okay, then just um, name, <laughs> not the file name, because you can't see it. Anyways, let's continue. Uh, when we have load all the settings, it should select. Mm, let me see. LB dot images. No, I. First of all, you gotta. Or you can uh, use try too, but I prefer to use if because it takes. Um, because the try method takes more time. I think I don't really know. I need to test it. <laughs> so let's say let LB dot image items dot count is more than zero and if it is more than zero then lb dot images dot uh, oh, selected index equals zero so it selects this so it selects the first index so let's double click it so we can go to the selected change and yeah and um, uh, oh, we need to add one more thing. I don't think you're gonna understand it, but I do. File lists as new list of string. So this is a array of string to say it like that. 
and on here just um, file dot full name. I'm gonna show you what I mean with this. So dot clear and uh, yeah, here it is. Now when all this setting loads, it also loads the full file name in an array. Yeah, in the code, so you can't see it, but the code know it. So uh, let's take pick no pb image dot image equals no image dot from file file lists and then take the index of the selected index selected index as, and as you see now it should work yeah here we go all the images <laughs> yeah uh, one thing and think I'm gonna leave it to uh, what should I leave it to stretch no send yeah stretch stretch in the image or no that won't be good zoom then <laughs> and let me resize the form to a little a bit a little bit bigger so here you can see all these things on there oops sorry directory for far yeah wrong directory I mean and here you can see all the images and now when all these are done we can go for example to the here and just type in that and then uh, dim dl dlg as new folder browser directory dialog and folder what 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 okay it's good then type in dlg dot selected path equals folder and then dlg dot show new oops I pressed the wrong button cancel equals true and then dlg dot root oh no not that and uh, description you can here you can change the description um please please choose a a direct uh, sorry my phone a directory yeah please choose a directory I don't think that's spelled right but <laughs> um, yeah anyways if dlg dot show dialog equals win those dot forms dot dialog result dot okay then the folder is dialg dot blah 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 selected path and then load all settings no not that uh, not load folder I mean load folder so let's try it out I think it should work and it selects there my uh, let me find a folder where I got images yeah uh, wh what's the name again I don't remember uh -huh. so let me go to Jonas which is my name and my images and let me just choose this What's wrong? What's wrong? Let me see. Uh -huh. Okay, I know what's wrong. I know what's wrong. Sorry, sorry about that. Uh, the index was out of bound. It cannot be negative or. Yeah, okay. That's okay. We just add a try function for that and index out of range da -da 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 -da. and let's try again and uh, what the why did it let me take a look at the code ah uh, I know I know I know sorry dot items dot clear <laughs> sorry about that here it is so 
it's a little simple thing. Um, let me find another folder with images. Hmm. What's the directory of this? Okay, so let me just go to this folder. Uh, C users public and uh, pictures. Here it is, all the cool images. So, thanks for watching, and uh, uh, please leave a comment below of what you want me to make, and I'll make it. <laughs> so, see ya, guys. Yeah, bye.